are ready for our final competition, the aggro crag, that big bad mountain behind me. Let's go to Mo and see where we stand. Mo. After four events, Delia in blue is in the lead with 1,000 points. In second place, Marnie in red with 900 points. In third place, John in purple with 400 points. That's where they stand before the crag. Let's see how they got there. And Delia with a magnificent performance. Look at that perfect placement and a nice soft touch as she admires her shot right there and gets back up to the elastic bridge to grab another basketball and keep on going. And there is Maniacal Marnie. Maniacal Marnie almost losing her footing there, but stretches across and grabs a hold of the slide for life and good form as she tucks in her knees and then gets ready to get into the elastic jungle. And there's Johnny. Yeah, the bad man Johnny getting in there, getting in the elastic jungle and putting his head down and just fighting his way through, crawling and seeing the light of day, seeing the wall climb, and knowing that the end is at the free fall bag as he jumps, boom, bang, and then we go to totally tubular, a close competition right here with all three of our players, neck and neck, tube for tube, but right here, as you can see, Delia, or actually you can't see, but Delia, and there's was Mo signaling that she did not hit with her hand the other end of the pool, and so was disqualified in this event as Marnie continued paddling her way, kicking her way to a first place finish in this event, totally tubular, and then there's John back up in there. He finished in third in a tie. And there's John right here, jumping over the hurdles and grabbing a hold of the elastic bridge as he climbed up there and locked in on that one. Final ascent. And they are all ready right now, folks, for the Agro Crag event. This big mountain behind me right here. A lot of surprises for our players. Slime floods, snow avalanches, rock slides, smoke in their eyes, water in their face. Let's go to referee Mo for the rules. Mo! Players will start at the sound of my whistle. Each player has an identical side of the mountain to climb and may not cross into another player's path. Now during their climb, our players must light up each of eight activators located on their side of the crag. The first player to activate all of the targets, including the final one at the peak of the mountain, will receive first place points. Mike. So the aggro crag getting ready for our players right here and our players getting ready and psyched up to climb that mountain. Let me just remind you that the points have skyrocketed in this final event. Third place, 375 points. Second place, 550. And first place, 725 points. Let's get this thing started, Mo. Players, on your mark. Get set. And they are off. Now Delia with 1,000. Marnie with 900. John with 400. Who's going to get up there first? And there, as you take a look at Delia, there's a look at John as he hits a first X winner. And Marty, it's a close competition right now, folks. There's only 1,000 points between. 100 points, I'm sorry, between Marty and Delia. Who's it going to be? Look at this, folks. Three ways. Who's it going to be at the top? Oh, oh, she slipped. Marty slipped. And Delia looks like she's first. And then John and Marty coming in next. Oh, folks, what a finish on that one. As you see our players a little bit winded at the top of that mountain. Let's go to Mo for the official results. These are the results of our aggro crag. In first place, Delia in blue. In second place, John in purple. In third place, Marnie in red. A fantastic finish right there. And our players, as you see, Marnie climbing up the mountain and hitting the actuators neck and neck with our other players at this point. It was a three-way tie on that portion. The rocks come tumbling down and look at the view from the top of the mountain as Delia and Marnie close the whole game, all of our events here today and just showing right there at that point. And there, right there is when Marnie slipped 
but she held on and finished. And Delia knocking in first place on that one. A fantastic performance by all our players here today. And now we're going to go to Mo and check our final leaderboard standings. Hey, Mo. These are the final standings. In first place today is Delia in blue with 1,725 points. In second place is Marnie in red with 1,275 points. And in third place, John in purple with 950 points. All right, and we have the bronze medal going to John. John coming back with a second place finish. John Batman Hilton, the bronze medal going to him. A second place finish in the aggro crack today. Bronze medal. Marnie getting the silver. A tenacious competitor. Fabulous performance here today. And now the gold medal, ladies and gentlemen, to our winner today, going to Delia. Let's give her a piece of that giant glowing rock, the aggro crack, and give her a piece and to hold high for everyone to see. All right, and now we're gonna come in here and talk to her. John, what do you think about that aggro crack event, my man? There's a lot of surprises in there, and um, you just had to get in there, get up there, and to get it without um, without slipping or nothing. Just had to really keep your balance. All right, good job. You kept your balance well. And let's go right in here and find out about Marty. What do you think of your performance here today? Well, if I wouldn't have slipped, I would have gotten a better <laughs> to get ch chance to get first. But you did fantastic. Delia, you have a good time today. Sure did. No ifs, ands, or buts. These kids got guts. Do you have it? All Guts players compete in Reebok athletic shoes who remind you that on Planet Reebok, there are no limits.